Sony, Samsung, LG and Panasonic have all unveiled new smart TV operating systems designed to let you channel hop, stream content and browse the web more smoothly than ever before. We compare the latest interfaces. Sony has said that all its new 4K TVs and some HD models will come with Android TV on board. Google has optimised the software, seen on phones and tablets, for use on the big screen. You get a simple and colourful user interface to navigate through the apps, channels and TV menus. You can control the TV with your voice and Google Cast means you can stream content to the TV from other devices such as tablets. Tizen OS, previously seen on Samsung smartwatches, is now powering the brand's new smart TV system for 2015. You can quickly jump into the apps, web browser and other services via a bar of brightly coloured icons that appears at the bottom of the screen. You get all the usual apps you'd expect from Samsung TV, including plenty of catch-up TV, but also, as Tizen is open source, it should be easier for developers to create new ones. Just like Samsung and Sony, Panasonic has a brand new smart TV system, powered by Firefox, who you'll know from the popular web browser. Available on selected 2015 Panasonic TVs, Firefox OS gives you a clean and simple user interface, including a customizable home screen on which you can pin your favorite apps, services, and even TV channels. Introduced last year at CES by LG, WebOS has been updated for 2015 with a refreshed design. You still get a launcher bar to access all your favourite apps and other services, but the system runs much faster and apps will load more swiftly. LG has also introduced a new Magic TV remote with a refined design and more functionality. We've been critical of versions in the past, so we're hopeful that this is an improvement. Click the links below for more on this, more on the best TVs of CES 2015 and everything else from the show.